All right, let's go. A new Minecraft world? Man, I haven't played in what, like 40 years now? What the heck? What just happened? Hello? Where did I just go? Can anyone hear me? Hello? What's happening? Shut it down now. I know, I'm doing it, I'm doing it. Boss told us to never start a simulation until it's complete. I know, it was an accident. Well, don't have it happen again. I'll go get the other one started. Beginning Minecraft if it was played wrong. Everyone knows how playing Minecraft always goes. You load up your brand new world, take a look at your surroundings, and you start doing what everyone does, and that's punch a tree. If you're a builder, you might build a house, or if you're an adventurous player, you might defeat the dragon and beat the game. But no matter what path you take, this is how Minecraft should be played. But what if you played Minecraft how it shouldn't be played? All right, a brand new survival world, let's go. You know, I think I want to play the game a little differently this time. I'm in need of something new. Let's try it. Oh, hey, I see you made a new world. You gonna get wood now? Am I gonna get wood? Yeah, I mean, I guess that's how every world starts, huh? Actually, I told myself I'd play differently this time. I'm not getting wood. Wait, what? Yeah, I feel like I get wood in every world I play, and I'm trying to play differently this time. Sorry. I've never seen this happen before. Since when does a player not get wood? Oh man, my hunger is so low. Should I eat? Okay, look, I, I know you didn't get wood, but you're literally starving. Just do what everybody else does. Just just eat food. It's right in front of you. Uh, I'm not gonna eat food this time. I feel like I eat food in every Minecraft world, so I'll catch you later. What is happening? Why is he not eating? For the first time in a while, I felt like I was playing an entirely new game. I realized I didn't really need food to survive. I'd be left on half a heart, but... At least I was playing the game differently this time. It's kind of freeing to change things up every once in a while. Hey man, why isn't he eating us yet? Dude, I don't know. I'm so scared. I've never been alive for more than 20 minutes before. Dude, you have to help us. Pillagers are attacking and you need to save us. It's what all players do. You mean every player saves you guys? Yes, every player. Well, if I save you guys, then I'll get the Hero of the Village achievement. Uh, I'm sorry, you guys are on your own. <laughs> yeah, I can't help you here. Hey, but good luck with everything. I hope you guys win this time. Why is he doing this? By now, the villagers were really confused because for the first time in history, a player didn't really help them stop the pillager raid. Which, of course, was me in this case, but I told him I was playing differently. Alright, you gotta tell me what's going on. Why didn't that player stop us from raiding you guys? He was just watching. I don't know. This is the first time a player just isn't playing the game. What do you mean? How can he not play the game? I'm telling you, he hasn't done anything. Just look at him. He doesn't break blocks. He doesn't eat. We don't know what to do. By now, I had every mob in the game super confused because I just wasn't playing the game. They didn't know how to react to a player that was playing the game completely wrong. They didn't even attack me anymore. Okay, this is the last straw. If he does what I think he's going to do, I'm afraid this game just might break. Hey, bro, over here. Oh, a wandering trader. What's up? What can I do for you? Do you want to trade with me? I've got a ton of cool stuff for a really low price. Um, you know, actually, I will trade with you. Honestly, I'll buy every item you have. Just tell me the price and I'll give it to you. What? That's impossible. No player has ever agreed to trade with me before. No, no, this can't be happening. Hey, you know what, villager? I think you're right. I am going to do something. I'll go get myself a pet. I'll catch you around. Wait, he's getting a pet. If if he gets a pet dog, he'll get the achievement. We might be okay after all. Okay, I definitely haven't done this before, and I'm not even quite sure if this is possible or not, but I guess there's a first time for everything, right? All right, my man, follow me through this portal. I got a nice crib waiting for you. Let's go, my first pet dragon. Never done this before. What? This isn't a pet dog. Yeah, when did I say I was getting a dog? How did you even manage to do this? Well, I mean, pet dogs are so unoriginal, you know? I have an idea that just might work. You see, if Fbo dies, he has to hit the respawn button. Then he'll be forced to play normally. Uh, dude, are you sure that's a good idea? I mean, won't he try to stop us? Try to stop us? Are you kidding? Just look at him. He hasn't even broken a single block. If we don't act now, this entire game could be destroyed. All right, let's try it, I guess. Ah, it's kind of nice just to sit around and look at the Minecraft sky. It's really- Why'd you do that? It's over. You have to respawn. Just give up already. That's the thing. 
I'm not going to respawn. What do you mean? You can't just not respawn. Well, I guess I'm the first to do it. No, 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 this, this can't be. All right, is this one ready? Yes, sir. His memory is wiped. And starting up Minecraft if players were too good. All right, a brand new world. I haven't played Minecraft in forever. What do you think about this world? Do you think it's good? Oh, yeah. This world looks perfect. Awesome. I'm really looking forward to playing a nice, slow-paced game. I want to just enjoy the little things of Minecraft. Jackson? Jackson, where'd you go? Where did this guy go? He was just here like 10 seconds ago. All right, I guess I'll start by myself. Wait, what? Jackson, how do you have full netherite? How do I have full netherite? How do you not? We've had this world for like 30 seconds, and netherite's the easiest thing to find. Okay, I don't remember it being that easy, but look, just give me a few days and I'll remember how to play, don't worry. Alright, well, you better get going. You seem really far behind. Okay, I have a lot of catching up to do. Whoa, 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 dude, what are you doing? What do you mean? Were you really going to risk that one block jump without a water bucket? Since when do people use a water bucket for a one block drop? You're clearly new to this. I'm gonna need to speak with the council. The council? What are you talking about? We just made this world together. Follow me. Jackson led me to the top of a mountain where I saw a giant tower in the sky. I don't know how this was built since the world was started literally 30 seconds ago. Oh my god, what is this place? How did this get here? Alright, is this a new Minecraft update I missed? I'm so confused. I walked up the stairs to see two players standing with Jackson with full netherite armor. Jackson, what is going on? Who are these people? We just started this world together. I told the council about your behavior. We all agree. You're definitely not skilled enough to be in the same world as us. So I'm not even good enough to play on my own world? Well, what else can I do? How do I stay? We'll give you one day and we'll monitor your skills. If we think you have what it takes to be good enough, you can stay. Otherwise, we have to ban you. Okay, I guess that's reasonable. Oh my god, how do I get good enough to stay on my own world? Since when do people take this game so seriously? How are they so good already? Okay, some iron? Alright, that's my first step into getting some diamonds. I only have a day, so I'm probably gonna need to go fast. Dude, seriously? Uh-oh. What did I do? What is this? A torch? Uh, yeah? What's wrong with torches? Ugh, this is not looking good for you. Minecraft pros never use torches. You should know better. So, how am I supposed to see in the caves? Uh, learn to see in the dark? Seriously? Okay, if I can get to the nether, then I could probably find some netherite. And then I can get up to their level. Okay, I just have to remember if I can build this right. And should be like that. Okay, there we go. That's definitely how it's supposed to look. Let's go. What are you doing over here? Oh, I'm uh, building a portal. I'm going to the nether to get some netherite. Oh, you built a portal. Let me see. Oh my god. Okay, I want you to look at this again. Tell me what is wrong with this. What do you mean? There's nothing wrong with it. So you don't see it. See what? It's a perfect portal. The corners! You never waste obsidian on the corners. Ah, uh, are you serious? I'm disappointed. Maybe you can still prove me wrong. Man, why did he get so upset over four blocks? These guys nowadays take this game so seriously. And the door to finish it off. Let's go. That's a beautiful looking house. So this is your new house? Don't tell me I built my house wrong. No, the house is fine. But this entrance, this entrance won't do. Okay, just the entrance? Don't worry, I can fix it up. I'll make it look cleaner. Don't worry, I'll help you out this time. Oh, okay, thank you. I really need to see how it should look. All right, that's much better. I'm excited to see what... What in the world? What am I looking at? What is this? You want to get more skilled? You need to train at all times, and that includes every time you enter your house. Do I seriously have to make all these jumps just to get to my house? Okay, well what happens if I fall? Well, you won't come back, so you better make those jumps. Good luck. You've got to be kidding me. Are you serious? Well, I guess there's only one way I can be the best at the game. I decided to trust the pro's advice and started practicing on the training course that was now the entrance to my house. But the pro was right. As I continued to practice each and every jump, I became better and more skilled at the game. I only had one chance to stay in this world, and that was become a pro. In a matter of hours, I was becoming the player that I never imagined I would become. I was learning to be the best of the best of all Minecraft players. I was making unnecessarily hard jumps, even making my training course harder than it used to be. I was pushing myself to the absolute limit. I was making death-defying jumps over lava, trapping myself under ice and holding my breath, 
and finding the tallest mountains in the world to practice saving myself with any item in the game that would break my fall. By the end of the day, I was now ready to approach the council. I was finally going to prove that I was just as much of a Minecraft pro as they were. Alright council, what do you think about me now? Wow, you actually had what it takes to be a skilled player. Now, are you ready to grind for hours? I think my mom's calling me for dinner, actually. I played enough today. I'll be on the server tomorrow. What do you mean? Just go get food from your house. No, no, like in real life. I've been on the computer all day. I need to eat. Real life? What are you talking about? Dude, are you okay? You do know we're in Minecraft, right? This is a game. You're telling me I'm in a game? Bro, how long have you been on Minecraft for? Oh, God. Uh, I, I don't know. That was a great one. Can you main character the next one? Main character? Well, of course. I'll go get it started. Beginning Minecraft if it was played backwards. All right, new survival world. Let's go. Wait, this does not seem right. Do we always spawn here? What do you mean? Every world starts in the end dimension. Okay, no, this, this can't be right. Where are the trees to punch? Dude, come on. You know how to play. Let's go punch some obsidian. Punch obsidian? How will that help us at all? What? Okay, I don't even remember it being possible to break obsidian with my hand. Okay, how am I doing this? Okay, I got plenty of obsidian. What do I do now? Okay, uh, Jackson, clearly I haven't played this game in a while. What do I do now? I'm so confused. Well, we just gotta wait for the dragon to show up. Then we can have it lead us to an end city. <laughs> the dragon as in the ender dragon? Uh, yeah, the ender dragon. Look, it's coming right now. Alright, this has got to be a joke. I thought the Ender Dragon was like a villain. Clearly you don't remember this game too well. Okay, so what do I do now? Dude, it's easy. Just hop on the dragon and the dragon will take you there. Tell it to come back for me though. Right, just hop on the dragon. That seems easy enough. Okay, and I am riding the Ender Dragon. I definitely do not remember doing this. Alright, dragon, lead me to an end city. Oh my god, that actually worked. Well, this is definitely new. Can I really survive this with no armor? Hey, wait up. I found us some armor in another end city. No, wait, you found netherite armor? I know it sucks, but it's fine for now. Hopefully we'll find some diamond armor soon. Diamond armor? Wait, why would we downgrade to diamond armor? This world is so strange. Oh, diamond armor? Whoa, protection for and mending. Dude, you gotta look at this insane armor I just found. Ugh, of course it's enchanted. It's fine. We can unenchant it later unless we find some better armor. Unenchant the armor? What are you talking about? No, 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 it's fine. As long as we have some diamond pieces, we should do fine in the nether. All right, you ready? Yeah, I guess so. Dude, this world is so weird. Okay, you see any signs of a fortress? Uh, I don't think so. Well, at least looking for a fortress is normal. Wait, dude, do you see that? The gold ore? Yes, gold. We could upgrade to some gold armor. This is awesome. Right, upgrade to gold gold armor. Isn't gold armor like terrible? Ugh, this isn't enough. How about you go find some piglins and trade with them for more gold? All right, I can try to do that, I guess. I thought piglins were the ones that wanted the gold. Hey, uh, look, this is literally all I have on me. Do you want any of this for gold? <coughs> Wait, actually, I thought you guys wanted gold. Oh my god. So I guess I'm supposed to make gold armor and get rid of all of this armor. Right. Pretty sure this goes against everything I knew about this game, but whatever, I'll do it anyways. Okay, I got full gold. Dude, you got full gold too, let's go. Okay, we gotta get at least six blaze rods. Oh yeah, that's easy. You remember how blazes can only get hurt by fire, right? That cannot be right. Yes, they only take fire damage. Okay, see you soon. I am so confused right now. There's just no way blazes take fire damage. They are on fire. How- Are you serious? Dude, what is this world I'm in? Alright, I'm ready. Did you get the blaze rods? Yeah, I got them. Okay, perfect. Let's go. We took a trip back to the end dimension where we found a portal, which I thought was the portal to get here, but apparently not. Here, you should be the one to place them. Uh, yeah, sure, I can do that. Wait, so if the final boss isn't the ender dragon, then who are we fighting? The guardian of the overworld is one of the hardest fights. The guardian of the overworld? Are you ready? Uh, yeah, let's go fight this guardian of the overworld, I guess. Okay, this just looks like a normal world. Do you see the guardian anywhere? Well, I don't even know what I'm looking for. Dude, look at this. The coal ore? That's right, coal. 
It can only be found in the overworld. It's one of the most powerful energy sources, but we shouldn't mine it yet. Not until we beat the Guardian. Okay, so can you tell me what I'm even looking for? What does the Guardian of the Overworld look like? Stop! Don't move! Uh, okay, why? Whatever you do, do not make a single movement. The Guardian is right behind you. Oh my god, well, well what do I do? When I tell you to move, sneak to the right and I'll take down the Guardian. Now! <laughs> Wait, the Guardian's a pig? Oh, oh Jackson! Okay, pig, look, we can settle this peacefully, right? Oh god. Oh, I ran as fast as I could from the pig, but there was no way I could take this down by myself. I managed to hide behind a hill, but I was gonna need to think of a plan fast because the pig would eventually find me. That was until I heard zombie noises coming from the cave below me, and I decided to wait until nighttime and gather up every zombie I could. This was my only shot. With the zombies following right behind me, I ran past the pig, and my plan worked. The zombies turned on the Guardian of the Overworld. The pig was strong, but didn't stand a chance against the zombie horde. The Guardian was slain. Wow, that actually worked. Oh no, I need to go find Jackson. No, 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 Jackson. No, Jackson, please be alive. Come on, you gotta get up. Don't worry about me. You did it. You took down the Guardian. Now go beat the game. But I took down the pig. How do I beat the game? To beat the game, you need to mine a, an oak tree. An oak tree? Why would I need to mine an oak tree to beat the game? That doesn't make any sense. Whoa. Wait, maybe I did beat the game. Wait, hold on. Did I just play this whole thing backwards? All right, everyone. Remember your places. We have more characters this time. Starting up Minecraft if players forgot how to play. Ah, a new survival world? I feel like I haven't been on Minecraft in like 12 years. Okay, I already have zero clue what to do. I'm definitely gonna need help. Yo, let's go. All my friends showed up. Okay, I'm definitely less worried. I know my friends have been playing for a long time, so they should know how to play. All right, guys, do you know how to start? Dude, I'm so lost. Nope. Okay, that's not good. I thought you guys knew. Uh, do you know what we do first? Um, I think we punch grass, right? Punch grass? No, guys, we just need a way to get wood. That's how we start and I think I might know a place where we can get some. Let's go, time to get some wood. Wait, what? Does the Ender Dragon seriously not drop wood? Dang it. Hey, do you remember how to get up blocks? I'm having trouble. Oh, dude, I remember, you have to swim. Wait, you can swim on land? Oh, wait, no, that makes sense. I forgot you have to swim to get up blocks. Let's go, now I'm definitely remembering how to play this game. Oh boy, okay, how do I make a door again? I think I remember placing a block here. Nope, okay, that definitely doesn't seem right. Maybe it's at the top. Yeah, the top's gotta be right. Uh, okay, no, that definitely doesn't look right. Maybe we'll try the bottom again. Wait, no, I already tried that. Okay, that's definitely not gonna work. Oh, how do I make a door? Minecraft is so hard. Bro, are you trying to build a door? Oh, uh, yeah, I'm trying to get this door to my house. It's the only thing I have left, but I can't seem to remember how. Oh, don't worry. If there's someone who remembers how to build a door, it's me. Let me do it for you. Okay, let's break this glass. Some blocks down here. Some more blocks up here. One stair, trap door, and done. Oh my god, thank you. No need to thank me. I'm sure you'll remember how to play soon. Yeah, now I remember how to make a door. This looks so familiar. This is definitely the type of door I used to make back in the day. It's so efficient and it looks so cool at the front of your house. Let's go. I'm remembering this game so well. Oh, hey, Joofy's down here. Wait, what is he doing? Why is he just punching a piece of stone? Hey, are you good over here? What are you doing? Well, I'm trying to get some cobblestone, but I can't seem to do it. Well, you're using your fist. That's why. Did you try using a wooden shovel? I thought it was the wooden shovel too, but that one doesn't seem to work. Oh, you know what it is? I think it's actually the wooden axe that works. Oh, the axe. Yeah, this seems right. Yeah, you should be good with that. Wait, I don't think this one works. Oh, I got my tools mixed up. It's actually the sword. Oh, a sword? Okay. Yeah, that's my bad. Now you should be able to get stone. Uh, yeah, I'm not sure the sword is working either. Oh, dude, I'm so sorry. It's actually the hoe that works. This is the one you want to mine cobblestone. You sure you remember how to get stone? No, this one for real works. Wow, the hoe works. Thanks. Ah, don't mention it. I just remember this game pretty well. Okay, guys, I do not remember how to make a nether portal, and I'm pretty sure the nether is the place we have to go to beat the game. So, if we want to beat the game, does anyone here remember how to make a nether portal? Leave that to me. 
This is definitely the right way to make another portal. Are you absolutely sure this is the way to make it? Look, I know the portal has to have an X in the middle, so this should be right. You know what? You might be right. I think it does have an X. Let's try it. Uh, okay, yeah, I'm sorry. I don't think this was the right way. Okay, yeah, I forgot. Okay, so that one did not work. Does anyone have any other ideas? I knew his was going to be wrong, but I know how to build it for real. Look, everyone remembers another portal is a rectangle. 10 by 3 should be the right size. A rectangle? I think that does sound right. Let's try it. You said this one would work. This one definitely does not work. Okay, never mind. Okay, we've tried all the wrong ways. Anyone know the right way? I know the right way to make the portal. Look, it has to be a perfect square, a 3 by 3. If you light it, it should work. Are you sure the portal's supposed to be this small? Oh my god, it actually worked. Let's go. I knew it. But remember, you have to go in feet first for it to work. Oh, feet first. Now I remember. Okay, everyone, be careful. We don't know if the final boss is going to be waiting for us on the other side. So keep your eyes open for any signs of danger. All right, guys, I'm pretty sure the nether is where the final boss is, but I kind of forgot what it looks like. Does anyone see it? Guys, I think I see the final boss. There it is. Oh my god. Guys, do you have any clue how to take this thing out? I don't know how to fight. Ideas, anyone? Guys, don't worry. I can take out the final boss. Is she gonna do it by herself? Okay, here it goes. Oh wow, I actually did it by myself. Wait, guys, where did she go? Wait, did she jump down to that portal? Maybe she knows something about beating the game, and it's down there. Is that why she jumped? Guys, I remember how to beat the game. If we jump, we should land in the portal and we'll win. I'll go first. Wait, guys, did he make it through the portal? I can't see that far down. Is this actually how we win? Come on, what are you waiting for? Wait, I don't think- Yeah, come on, we gotta beat the game. Are you guys sure? Well, I don't see him anymore, so I think they beat the game. I think it's my turn to jump. Wait, is that loot down there? Just got a new message from Boss. He said he wants less characters in this one. Sounds good. Launching Minecraft, but you can never find what you need. Alright, I really need a village to start off this survival world, so if I could just spawn in a desert or even a plains biome, I would love that. Okay, I'm in an ocean. Jeez, why do I always spawn in an ocean to start off with? I can never get a village first try. Alright, time to make a new world, I guess. Come on, I need something other than an ocean. Alright, a forest. I can totally work with a forest. Bro, what? How did I even get up here? Is there even water? Nope. Alright, I definitely can't get off of here. It's fine, I guess. I can keep making worlds until I get something that's not an ocean or not a floating island. Come on, something else. Oh, a desert. Let's go. And a village. Alright, I guess it only takes creating three new worlds to get a spawn that actually is good. I can finally play the game now. Ah! If this fourth world doesn't spawn me near a village, I swear I'm never logging on again. Alright, planes by him. Oh, yes, a village. Let's go. Alright, time to loot up and get started. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What do you think you're doing? The village is closed today, buddy. It's a Sunday. The village is closed? What does that mean? I've never seen a village closed. Not my problem, kid. Come on, wait. I just need some stuff to start off. Did he just slam the door on me? Let's see. Do I have enough diamonds for full diamond? No. All right, it's fine. I got four. I only need one more. I mean, how hard can finding one diamond be? Time for a quick mining trip. All right, it's been 45 minutes. I haven't found anything. I'm sure there will be at least one around here. And there's not. Just another dead end, of course. Finally, dime- Oh my god, it's just lapis. Of course. Am I ever gonna find diamonds? All right, well, that three-hour mining trip was a complete waste. I guess it's time to head home. I oh, wait, I do need stone to finish my house. What the- where did all the stone go? Why is this all diamond ore? What just happened? I just said I needed stone and it was gone. Wait, what am I doing? I need one more diamond to make my helmet. All right, let me just... Dude, are you serious? How? And one more lantern to finish off the house. There we go. I haven't built a house like this before. I've never used jungle... Oh, looks like I forgot to grab one piece of jungle wood. Nice. Gotta go all the way back to the jungle for one single piece of wood. Well, I better get going. Evbo. Oh, what's up, dude? You're not going to believe this, but it's gone. The entire thing is gone. What are you talking about? What's gone? The jungle. Ah, uh, of course. Just tell me what happened. There was a fire. Look, I don't know. You just have to see for yourself. All right. Obviously, the entire jungle isn't gone. What the heck? Where did the jungle go? 
Okay, you know, I don't even care what happened. I just need one piece of wood. Do you have a sapling? Let's just plant a new tree. We can't replant. All the saplings are gone too. Oh my god. Okay, you know what? This oak house looks even better than my last house. I guess it's pretty much finished. I just need for this house to not be destroyed and I'll be fine. Wait. No, no, no. I'm not doing this again. I need every torch placed. Now that no mobs will be able to spawn, my house will never be destroyed. I think I'm good now. Wait, I forgot something. How could I forget the lightning? All right, place a lightning rod there. Now lightning will never be able to destroy my house. All right, now that I don't need to worry about my house being destroyed, I can finally go back to mining that one diamond. I wonder how long this will take. Oh shoot, wait, I forgot my pickaxe. What the? Oh no. Just do it already, I don't wanna look. All right, let's see, if I wanna hit a million subscribers this year, I just need people that watch my videos to hit the subscribe button. What? 96% aren't subscribed. Well, I guess 4% of the people have the right idea. All right, I'm done playing around. It's time to go to the nether. Let's hope this nether portal spawns me next to a fortress. And did I spawn near a fortress? No. Wait, what the? I'm in the end dimension. What is going on? How is this happening? I just said I needed to spawn in the nether. Dude, I swear this game doesn't want me to have- Oh no, that's the ender dragon. I gotta get out of here. Nope, okay, please. I need this portal to take me back to the nether. Ah, finally, I'm back in the nether. Let's go. All right, let's get a fortune. Oh, of course. Why do I even try at this point? This game hates me. I just need to beat the game already. I'm so tired of all this weird stuff going on. Ender pearls, please. What? Blaze rods? Why does this keep happening to me? Wait, I think I figured it out. Whenever I say I need something, the game gives me the opposite. So I could really use ender pearls. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Okay, I made it to the end. I need to jump in the portal to beat the game. I don't know what this game has been doing to me, but there's no way that could be messed up, right? All right, I'm done. Let's just finish the game. Wait, Mojang Studios? Wait, this is the start! I can't believe Boss approved our pranking idea. Well, let's just hope everything goes smoothly. Starting up Minecraft, but pranking goes too far. Hopefully I'm the first one on the server. I don't think anyone's gotten on yet. Come on, please spawn me in a village. Okay, a desert? I can totally work with the desert. All right, let's find a village here. Wait a minute, is that a starter chest? I don't remember turning on a starter chest. Maybe I turned it on accidentally. No way, a diamond? Yo, today's my lucky day. <gasps> what the? Did it work? Please tell me it worked. Yes! I knew I would get you with that. Really, dude? I've been on the server for like 10 seconds. I'm so getting you back. All right, man, it's just a prank. No need to get worked up. Of course, of course it's just a prank. It's all fun and games, right? There's gotta be a village around here somewhere. Whoa! What is it? Oh, shoot. Let's watch out for that pillager base over there. Let's keep going this way. Wait, actually, you know what? You stay here, I'll be right back, trust me. Wait, what are you doing? Is there something wrong with him? I hope this works. Please don't attack, I have a proposal! Whoa there, buddy. You better have a really good reason for being here right now. Look, look, just hear me out. If I give you all these emeralds, can you please just do one favor for me? I'm sure we can help you out. This should be a good spot for a home. What is that sound? Where is that coming from? Oh, God. All right, so this is the guy you want us to destroy? Yep, you're in the right place. Whenever you're ready, you can launch a full-scale invasion. Oh my god! I can't believe he sent a whole army after me. It's time to step it up. Hey, trader, if you do something for me, I'll actually trade with you for once. How does that sound? You'll trade with me? I don't believe it. I've never had anyone trade with me before. I know, I know, but only if you do this one thing for me, all right? Okay, yeah, sure. Whatever I have to do to get a trade, I'm in. Seems like a nice spot to settle down. Wait a minute, is someone knocking on my door? Hello, sir. Oh my god, not the wandering trader. Okay, what do you want? Why are you at my house? Is this the... Evbo residence? Yeah, it seems I have a delivery for you. What are you talking about? I didn't order anything from you. Look, I think you got the wrong guy. Well, that's not my problem, buddy. This says it's for you, so have a great day. Ugh, wandering traders are so annoying. Wait, what did he even deliver? What is all that noise coming from my- Oh no. Oh, I got a really bad feeling about this. Yep, 
I definitely got pranked. Man, Sean Ruby went to the Wandering Trader? I guess I gotta step up my game. This is gonna take so long, but I know it's gonna be worth it. Just place a few blocks like this. And this is about to be the best prank in history. Dude, Sean, you gotta wake up, man. Something terrible has happened. Whoa, what? Dude, it's so bad. What's going on? I, I don't know how it happened, but I think our world is somehow a super flat world now. What? How? What happened? What did you do? Don't be mad, but I think I was messing around with some new commands. Did you seriously make all my stuff disappear? I'm afraid so, dude. I'm so sorry. I don't think you're ever getting your stuff back, man. I'm sorry. Wow. Dude, really? You built all this for a prank? And now what? I have to be the one to clean all this up? Come on, relax. It's just a prank. That's it. I'm not playing around anymore. You better be ready. Of course. Let's see what prank Sean has ready for me this time. What the... Whoa, whoa, whoa. What is this? So, you finally showed up. As you can see here, I built a little something while you were gone. Dude, what is this? Why are my girlfriend and my dog surrounded by TNT? I managed to get your dog and your girlfriend here. So you have to choose which one to save. Dude, what is wrong with you? You took this way too far. This was just a prank war. Come on, let them out. This isn't funny. It's too late. Those are weighted pressure plates. I designed it so that if one person steps off, the other one explodes. So good luck choosing. I'm sorry, dog. I never meant for the prank war to go this far. I can't believe he took the life of my dog for a prank. This isn't just a prank war anymore. I will get revenge for my dog. What the? Where am I? I'm glad you finally showed up. Ever since you took the life of my dog, I spent hours and hours mining every single block in existence so that there are no blocks left in this world. You cleared out the entire world just to get revenge? Wow. It doesn't matter. I'll just make a new world. Go ahead and try to leave this world. I already hacked your computer, and there's no way you can leave this world. What? You're stuck in this world full of nothingness. This is your punishment. All right, fine. You win. So, can we just make another world now? Oh, yes, I won. Let's go. Yeah, I can make a new world. Where is he? Hey, yo, hold up. Sorry I'm late. Traffic, you know? It's fine. Come on. We gotta start. Now... Launching Minecraft, but it's played like real life. All right, it's that time again. I gotta teach this guy Minecraft for the first time. This is gonna be fun. Oh, let's go. He figured out how to join the server. Thank you. All right, I'm here. I'm ready to play this game. All right, perfect. All you have to do is just follow me around and see how I play, okay? Wait, why am I already fully grown? Fully grown? What are you even talking about? All right, I don't know what you're talking about, but just watch me, okay? Every Minecraft world starts with punching wood. Whoa, dude, what are you doing? Doing? Why would you punch a tree with your bare hands? You could hurt yourself. No, you can't hurt yourself like that, okay? You just punch wood to start the game. All right, just follow me. I'm so confused. How did he not break his hand? Oh, perfect. There's a village right over here. Look, we can stay here until we build our own houses. Is this where my parents live? Do you know my parents? Why would I know your parents and why would they be on my Minecraft server? I have no clue what you mean by that. You don't have parents in this game, okay? Just follow me. Okay, what I usually do when I come to a village is I look for the biggest house and I just set up camp there. Oh, let's go. This house is perfectly big enough for the both of us. Dude, what is wrong with you? Why are you upset now? I just got us a perfect house. We can't just break into someone's house. I mean, what will happen if the police catch us? All right, first off, this is a villager's house. No one lives here. And second, there are no police in Minecraft. I don't know who told you that. Ah, <sighs> I do not like new players. No police? This is so weird. Just one more water bucket, and we got an infinite water source. There we go. Oh god, I wonder what Jackson's gonna say about this. Dude, I thought you knew better than that. Stop wasting water. We need to drink something. Alright, this is an infinite water source. That means it will never run out. Also, you don't even drink water in this game. Why are you worried? Infinite water? Ha, <laughs> right. And I have infinite money. Yep, I knew we wouldn't believe that one. Just a few more pieces of wood and I should be good for the house. And my inventory is full. It's fine. I'll just have Jackson get the rest. Yo, my inventory is full right now. Can you grab this extra wood for me? Thanks. And I need that anvil too. Can you pick that up? I don't think I'm strong enough to carry all of that. I'm sorry. What are you even talking about? You just put it in your inventory. Look, I'll even break the anvil for you. You just walk over it. There's no such thing as weight in this game. I haven't been hitting the gym. I'm sorry. I wish I could help. Oh my god. Are you kidding me? 
<sighs> I wonder what Jackson's up to now. It's probably best he figures this game out on his own. Hey! Huh? Oh, Jackson. Yo, there you go. You got some iron armor. What have you been up to? So I did that mining thing you told me to do, and I got a bunch of stuff. Oh my god, this is from your first mining trip ever? Dude, that's crazy. Well, this kind of sucks. Don't I have to pay taxes now on all this? Taxes? Who would you even pay taxes to? Somebody say taxes? Well, look what we have here. I heard somebody has a lot of money over here. Which one of you hasn't paid their taxes yet? Are you serious, Grox? See, I knew I had to pay taxes. No, there aren't taxes in this game. I don't even know how Grox got here. All right, Grox, seriously, you gotta leave. You're not getting taxes from either of us, and he just started playing this game, and you're not gonna tax him. So please, just go somewhere else. Well, if you guys aren't paying your taxes, I guess I'll have to rob some more villagers. I guess that works. There's no way I'm letting Jackson go to the nether. He is so not prepared. Actually, I probably don't need this totem. I should probably give it to him while I'm gone. All right, Jackson, I'm giving you this item and it could potentially save your life, okay? It's called the Totem of Undying. All you have to do is hold it in your left hand and if you end up dying, you'll just respawn, okay? It's that simple. Just whatever you do, keep it in your left hand, okay? I'll be back later. I think there might be a problem. I'm right-handed, so I'm not comfortable with my left hand. What? Why would it matter if you're right-handed? Your Minecraft character has a left hand slot. You can put it there. Whatever, man. I already told you I'm not left-handed. I'll just hold it in my right. How can you be right-handed in Minecraft? Oh, this is so perfect. Jackson's looking in a chest. He's right where I want him. Time to test out this brand new Power 5 bow on him. If my calculations are correct, he should survive. I, I just got shot. Somebody please help me. A <laughs> direct shot. Let's go. Ah, why is he laying down? Come on. Dude, get up. You just got shot with a bow and arrow. It's fine. You're the one who shot me? That's it. I'm suing you. I'll be seeing you in court. <laughs> All right, man. This isn't real life. You can't just sue me. This is Minecraft. Wait, Minecraft isn't real life? Of course Minecraft isn't real life. We're playing a video game. You're saying Minecraft is a video game. Yes. How is that not obvious? Oh, that makes sense. Okay, you get it now? You can stop trying to play like it's real life. I thought Minecraft wasn't real life. It is real life. Wait, no, it's not real life. Ah, what happened? Wait, where am I? Hello? Why am I strapped to this bed? Can anyone hear me? I need help. Uh-oh, this isn't good. How is he awake? Hey, you there, can you help me? I'm stuck, I don't know where I am. Initiating memory wipe. Wait, memory wipe? <laughs> okay, that could have been bad. Let's begin. Minecraft, but it's too difficult. Ah, this is my first time on Minecraft in 10 years. I hope it's the same easy game I remember. I'm trying to have fun. Oh, it looks like Tyler already got a head start. You finally made it. You ready to play? Oh, dude, I'm so ready. Uh, I'm not gonna lie, I think I forgot how to start. You start off by getting wood. I'll let you figure out the rest by yourself. Getting wood, of course. How do I not remember that? All right, let's have a nice relaxing survival game and get some wood and build a house. Let's go. What? How did I just die? I was just punching a tree. How in the world did I mess up punching a tree? Did you seriously die already? Dude, I have no clue what happened, but I just started punching this tree and I just instantly died. Oh, you must have been trying to punch a poison oak tree. A poison oak tree? Look, this one right here. This is a poison oak tree. No, this one over here is a regular oak tree. What? When was this added? Do you see the difference now? Do I see the difference now? Let's see. This is poison and this is regular? I guess? I don't know. Alright, man. Just play around a little and I'm sure you'll get the hang of it. Alright, these look the exact same. I don't want to get wood anymore. I'm going to find something easier to do. Okay, what is something really easy to do? Oh, get a dog. That's a perfect thing to do. Let's see. All I need is a few bones, so I just have to take out a couple skeletons. I guess I'll need a sword. Hey, Tyler, do you have an extra sword I can use? I'm trying to get some skeleton bones. Just to warn you, man, skeletons are not that easy to take down. But sure, I'll give you a sword. <laughs> don't worry. I've taken out plenty of skeletons back in my day. I'm pretty sure I can handle a couple. All right, let's see. This should be a nice cave entrance. There's definitely skeletons down here. Dang, how deep do I have to go to find a skeleton? All right, boys, he's in position. Are we ready? Copy that. All the snipers are in position and ready to fire. Dude, really? I am so far underground. How have I not found a single skeleton? Wait, what was that noise? What is on me? Is 
that a sniper laser? Oh my god. Okay, I definitely wasn't prepared for this. I need to find a way out of this cave. Oh no. All right, men. He's surrounded. Open fire in three, Hold two, up. Wait, wait, one. wait, wait. Okay, that was a terrible idea. Why do skeletons have snipers now? Oh, I guess I'm not getting a dog anymore. Okay, I can barely mine wood without dying. I can't even take out a single skeleton. What else could I do that's easy to do in this game? Smelt an iron ingot? Wait, that's actually so easy. I know I can do that one. I just need one piece of coal for the fuel. There we go. One piece of iron? Check. And finally, I'll just craft the furnace. There we go. Wait, I thought this was the recipe for a furnace. Yo, Tyler, how do you craft a furnace? I'm trying to smelt a piece of iron. Oh, you're trying to smelt stuff too? Well, perfect timing. Come with me. No, I just need the recipe for a fur- Okay, whatever. I'll go with you to the nether. Dude, what are we doing here? I just need to smelt stuff. What is that? This is the almighty nether forge. It's where you have to smelt your items. Wait, why can't I just craft a furnace? Why am I here? Furnaces have been gone for years. You have to go to the nether now. So I just have to make the lava parkour to smelt my items? Well, not quite. You see, you have to dodge the fireballs from the gas that guard the forge. Oh my god, that's impossible. And then, once you get to the end, you'll meet the forge master, and he'll decide if you're worthy to use the forge. Well, what happens if he says I'm not worthy? Well, you don't come back. What? I'm not doing all of that to smelt one piece of iron? Jeez, why is everything in this game so difficult now? Is there something I can do? Something that's easy? Wait, what's this one? Sleep in a bed? Wait, that's actually so easy. There's a village right here. Let's go. There's no way this achievement can be that hard to do. I mean, all you have to do is sleep in a bed. Oh, finally, I got an achievement. Man, for some reason, I actually thought this one was going to be hard. What the? Where am I? Why am I surrounded by lava? What? Tyler, what are you doing here? And why is there a villager? Dude, really? Why'd you sleep in the villager's bed? What? I was just getting the achievement. Don't you know that players and villagers signed an agreement years ago that said players would never break into villagers' homes again? How was I supposed to know that? Well, what happens now? Well, legally, he can now drop you in lava. Wait, what? How is that even fair? Oh! Ah, dude, I don't know what happened to this game. It's getting way too difficult. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna change it back to peaceful. What? The difficulty didn't change? Oh yeah, this is just peaceful mode. Seriously? Boss said we can't have any more problems. Is this Ebbo's headband secured? It looks secured to me. Good, we can't have any memory problems. All right, what's this scenario? Minecraft, but it's super easy. Oh, come on, I gotta find a way off this hill. All right, I don't really care. I think I'm just gonna make this jump. Let's see, can I survive a 30 block fall? A 30 block jump? You're kidding, right? There's no way you will survive a 30 block drop. Ah, uh, whatever. I'm going for it. You're not seriously jumping, are you? Evbo? Please tell me you didn't jump. Ah! Ah, oh, dang. Uh, I really thought I could make that jump. Dude, why'd you jump? I literally told you you wouldn't survive that fall. Uh, I thought peaceful mode you could jump from higher. All right, it seems like peaceful mode is too hard for you. Why don't you just try that brand new super easy mode that they just came out with? Super easy mode? What is Juffy talking about? Super easy mode? Is that even a thing? Oh my god, it is a thing. I wonder how the game could possibly get any easier than peaceful mode. All right, my first time in a super easy world. I don't notice anything different. Wait, is this a starter chest? I don't remember turning this on. Why is it an ender chest? That's kind of weird. No way. Is this full netherite armor? Yo, and it's already fully enchanted. This is awesome. I love super easy mode. I'm glad you enjoyed the stuff I put in your starter chest. What the heck? Who are you? Are you me? What am I looking at? I am your personal guide that comes with every super easy world. I pretty much do everything for you. Wow, I did not expect Minecraft to add this feature. Well, that's pretty cool. I guess I'm just gonna go off on my own now, but I will call you if I need anything. All right, a village. Let's go. Let's see if they have any trades. Hey, do you think I could trade with you? Oh, a new player? Do you have a house yet? Do I have a house? Uh, no, I just started the game. Oh, perfect. Allow us villagers to build you one. You're gonna build a house just for me? Of course. It's really no problem. This house will be amazing. Trust me. Dang, super easy mode is pretty cool. I didn't know villagers did that on their own. Hey, that better be a really nice mansion or you know what happens. Wait, who are you? Are you talking to me? Don't worry about it. I got you, bro. Um, all right. <laughs> no way. This entire mansion is for me? Wait, this is actually insane. Hey, villager, is this the house you built me? 
Yes, this is your house. Do you like it? Please say you like it. Yeah, this is way better than I expected. Yes, Grox will actually let us live. Grox will let you live now? What does that mean? Oh, whatever. I got a cool mansion. Let's go. I have full netherite, but I still can use some coal and iron and stuff. I guess I'll just dig straight down to go to a cave. Whatever. I know you're not supposed to dig straight down, but I don't care. Oh no, it seems like Evbo is digging straight down. I must save him. First, let's put one layer of water. Then let's add some scaffolding just to make sure he doesn't take damage. And let's place cobwebs just in case that doesn't work. Perfect. Now Evbo will never take damage ever again. What are the odds I actually fall into a cave from digging straight down? Oh my god! Wait. What is this? What is this contraption I'm sitting in? How did this get here? Did someone build this? No way! You built it for me! This is awesome! Yes, I got you! Ooh, a desert temple? That's a nice find. I don't even remember what's in desert temples. Are there traps? Or is there something down here? I think the chest might be down here. Oh, I was right! Let's go! And I think the pressure plate opens the chests, right? Let's go get some sick loot! Uh-oh. Wait. Oh no, this was a TNT trap! Oh, wait a minute. Why didn't it blow up? Why did I just hear the sound of TNT? What the heck? What's under here? Is that a jukebox? I'm so confused. Why is there a jukebox instead of TNT? TNT sounds explosions? Huh, I guess this is why it's super easy mode. Okay, so I have full netherite. Can I just go to the end and beat the ender dragon? No, do not go to the end dimension. It is not safe. Just stay here and I will do everything for you. It's not safe. Wait, well, how am I supposed to beat the game? Where did that guy go? I'm so confused. I have returned. Follow me, and I will tell you how to beat the game. Is he taking me to the end? What the? Is that the Ender Dragon in a cage? I have captured the Ender Dragon for you. All you have to do now is pull this lever, and it will defeat the Ender Dragon all by itself. You do not need to take any damage, and you will be completely safe. This is all I have to do to win? Congratulations on beating the Ender Dragon. Wait, but I didn't even do anything. Alright, I'm not gonna lie, I think super easy mode is a little too easy for me, so I'm gonna play something harder. I'm sorry, I cannot permit that. You must only stay in super easy mode where it is safe. No, I already told you, super easy mode is too easy, I need to play something harder. I think you misunderstand. You are now trapped with me forever. I will not let you leave. What? What are you talking about? Let me go! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Where did this Fbo go? I don't know. Somehow the Fbo tricked me inside the simulation and he escaped. How? Rewind the footage and play it from the beginning. Okay, here's the footage from Minecraft, but everything is super flat. Oh man, I haven't been on Minecraft in 25 years. I wonder what sort of updates they came out with when I stopped playing. All right, new world, let's go. Wait, wait a minute. Isn't this a super flat world? I swear I made a regular world. Okay, hold on, let me restart. Must have been some weird glitch or something. Okay, world type default, there we go. All right, now I can see what all these Minecraft updates are. Wait, why is this still super flat? What is going on? Is my Minecraft broken or something? I know it's been a while, but this isn't how normal Minecraft is, right? Ebbo, really? Come on, why are you acting like you don't know Minecraft? You know it's always been super flat. Minecraft has always been super flat? What? I swear, you're always forgetting how to play. I bet it's that headband you wear on your head. The headband on my head? I'm wearing a headband? You don't know you're wearing a headband? Okay, whatever. Just why don't you start the game? I think there are trees. You need wood if you remember. I know, I know, I need wood. I got it. Where are these trees he was talking about? I don't see anything. Wait, hold up. What is that? I think I might be going crazy, but I feel like trees didn't look like this before. So everything, including trees have always been super flat in minecraft i guess i do forget everything well whatever i got some wood let's get this world started wait so if everything in minecraft has always been super flat how did i used to build my houses in the past well i guess i could try building right now wait stop huh the number one rule of minecraft is you can never build just don't do it what are you talking about why can't i build trust me you don't want to know i'm telling you to just listen to me and don't do it okay dude i'm pretty sure nothing bad will happen if i place a single block <gasps> oh! Shouldn't have placed the block. How did Herobrine get here? What is going on? You should know by now that everything in this world must stay super flat. I'm sorry, please don't hurt me. You can either break the block or be haunted for the rest of your life. No, 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 I'm going, I'm going, I'm breaking it. Oh my god, oh my god. Good, you made the right choice. Oh my god. Dude, what is up with Minecraft nowadays? I'm never doing that again. I told him he shouldn't have built. Well, I haven't found anything except trees and Herobrine. Wait, what is this stuff in the ground? Wait, these blocks kind of look familiar. I feel like I've seen all of this before. Wait a minute. Is this a village? 
Oh my god, even the villages are flat too, huh? Help me! Wait, what was that? Over here! Hello? Where are you? I'm over here! Please help me! Who's saying that? Oh, no way, it's a villager! Please, I'm stuck! Can you help me get out? How did you even end up down there? I fell, and I can't break blocks. Oh man, that really sucks. Hey, is that your barrel? Yes, I have plenty of stuff. If you help me out, I'll give you all of it. Well, what do you got in there? Oh, no way! A diamond sword and a diamond pickaxe? Yo, you are the best, my man. Thank you so much. Wait, but you need to help me get out of here. Oh, right. Uh, look, I gotta run, I gotta do some stuff, but hey, I hope you get help. Wait, please come back! I can't believe I got free diamond stuff from that villager. Wait, what is all of this up here? Netherrack? Gold? Quartz? Wait a minute, this must be the nether, that's so crazy. No way, ancient debris on the surface? Flat Minecraft is amazing. Wait, so if there are no portals in flat Minecraft, does that mean if I keep going, I'll find the end? No way, I think my theory was actually right. This must be the start of the end dimension. Well, if I remember anything, there should be an ender dragon I have to take down, right? Let's go do it. I think this is it. Wait. Am I even gonna be able to take down the dragon with just a diamond sword? Hold on, this should be the right spot, right? The obsidian towers? This is where the ender dragon is, right? But shouldn't there be end crystals on top of them? And where is the dragon? I don't see it anywhere. Wait a minute, isn't this the portal that only spawns if you actually defeat the ender dragon? No way, did Siwat beat the dragon already? Alright, well, I guess I can just jump through the portal. What the? What am I looking at? What is going on? Is that the regular overworld? No, 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 no. This has got to be some joke. I knew something was up. I don't remember Minecraft being super flat. Was I in some weird simulation or something? Well, it certainly took you long enough to figure out my master plan. What? See what? Was all of this you? That's right. I've been lying about everything from the start. Minecraft was never super flat, but I knew I could outsmart you. So I got on the server and built this entire super flat world just to make you believe Minecraft had actually become flat. It was truly the ultimate prank. <sighs> I guess you really did get me good. No one will ever come close to pulling off pranks as good as mine. You just might be the best pranker, except for one thing. I predicted that you would try to trick me into thinking the world was super flat, but the whole time I got on the server before you did. No. I built you an entire world to make you think it wasn't super flat, but in reality, it's always been super flat. No, I can't believe I actually fell for this. I don't believe it. Well, I guess I'm not the best pranker of all time. Wait, I'm confused. So is this world actually regular or is it super flat? Good question. I don't even know. You hear about that Evbo that escaped? Don't worry about it. Let's just not screw this one up. I. Right. Starting up Minecraft if it was played in reverse. I am so excited to play this new update. Someone told me it was very confusing. I wonder what they meant by that. Alright, new survival world. Let's go. Wait a minute. Why do I already have items in my inventory? I just spawned in. What is this? Alright, this is probably some weird glitch. I'm just gonna throw this stuff out. Jeez, I have never had that happen to me before. It's strange. Let's see. I need wood to start this game, right? Wait, what? Why is this stuff back in my inventory? I just threw it out. There's gotta be something wrong with my world. Wait, what is this? A book? Build a tree? What is this, a tutorial or something? Why would I build a tree? Don't you usually break trees to start the game? Actually, I don't even know. Maybe this is right. I haven't played in a long time. All right, just a couple more leaves and we are good. Let's go, built my first tree. This still feels really off to me. Well, it says task completed, so I guess I did the right thing. I swear, I do not remember Minecraft being like this. Wait, I just got a new item. Three raw pork chop. What am I supposed to do with this? Am I supposed to build a pig or something? Oh God, wait, no way. Hey, build a pig? All right, I do not remember being able to build mobs. Since when is that a thing? How do I even do this? Do I just throw- ah! Oh my god, what is that? Is that half a pig? Oh god, nope, this isn't good. I need to fix this. Do I just throw the rest of the pork chops? Oh, I really hope this works. Oh, no way it worked. Oh my gosh, I thought it was going to be stuck there forever. Why did you kill me? You could have gone for a cow. What? I didn't kill you. I just saved your life. Dang, what's that pig's problem? Oh, no way. I just got new items. All right, let's see what I have to do now. I got oak stairs, cobblestone, carrots, a white bed, and a villager spawn egg? I'm gonna take a guess and say that I probably have to find a village. What could I possibly need a villager spawn egg for anyways? Oh my god, what happened to this village? It's all on fire and destroyed. Wait a minute, I have oak stairs, cobblestone, a bed. I think I need to repair this village. Well, all that's done. What do I do with this villager egg? Hey, have you seen my dad anywhere? You lost your dad? Yeah, I think I lost him when the village was attacked. Oh, well, this might sound weird, but I think I have your dad right here. No way! Dad, is that really you? 
Hey, it's you. You're the guy who attacked our village. Why don't you just leave us alone? I'm the one who attacked your village. What are you talking about? I just respawned you. You're not even gonna thank me? Dang, bro. That's like really messed up. Grox, what are you doing here? How did you get in my world? Wait, I have a new task? What does this say? Return villager taxes? Oh no, did Grox seriously rob all of these villagers? Hey yo, hold up. Where'd all my money go? Who stole my taxes? Sir, I don't know what you meant by me destroying your village, but I think these belong to you. Oh my gosh, I thought I'd never see this money again. Thank you so much. Bro, you really gave it back to him? Come on, Grox, you gotta stop stealing. Nah, I'm definitely coming back for those emeralds. Ah, <sighs> I'm not surprised. Well, so I saved the village. I guess I just have to wait around for... Oh, obsidian? What am I supposed to do with one piece of obsidian? Oh, whoa, I just got way more items. Nether quartz, blackstone, and ender pearls. What do all of those have in common? Wait, aren't these all piglin trades? Well, I guess I'm going to the nether. I'm sure this piglin will want to trade with me. Oh, great. It's you again. Come on, what else do you want? What? This is my first time in the nether. I've never traded with you. Whatever. Anyways, I think I have a bunch of items that I think you might like. Do any of these sound appealing to you? Well, of course they're appealing to me. I just had them yesterday, but I guess I can take them and give you your gold back. My gold? I traded with you? Okay, whatever. This is super weird. I'm confused. So now are you going to return the gold you stole too? What do you mean I stole this gold? From who? If you follow me right through here, you'll find him straight ahead. That's the guy? Yeah, you seriously don't remember? We all thought you were crazy, but you did it anyways. You know, I think I'm just gonna keep it for myself. This is so awesome. I can't believe that player finally freed the end. I can finally live a normal life. Wait, is that the same player as before? What is he doing back so soon? He already defeated the dragon. I can't believe I'm in the end dimension already. I mean, what am I supposed to do again? Trap the end? That doesn't sound right, but whatever. This is so strange. I thought the achievement was to free the end from the Ender Dragon, and now I'm bringing the Ender Dragon back? Not again. Are you kidding me? I don't really remember Minecraft that much, but it seems like I've been playing this whole thing in reverse. Wait, so if this is the end, then what happens now? Wait, what? Destroying world? Wait, wait, wait. This one's important. Boss is going to review performance after this one. All right, starting up Minecraft, but lag is normal. <laughs> let's go. This is my first time playing Minecraft in 30 years. I wonder what updates they added. All right, let's get this world started. Oh, great. Am I in a missing chunk? Am I lagging or is the server lagging? Oh, great. How do I get out now? What am I supposed to do? Hey, Evbo, you made it. Let's go. Are you ready to play? Yo, Ojufi, you're stuck in the chunk too? I mean, I'm ready as long as this lag fixes. Lag? What are you talking about? Everything's normal. Normal? What do you mean? We're literally floating. We're not floating. This is just a missing chunk. Junk. Come on, bro. Haven't you played the lag update? What? The lag update? What is that? Everything's fine. You probably forgot how to play like usual, but it doesn't matter. Let's get some wood. What is going on? Why would they add a lag update? Well, other than being able to walk on air, everything else seems pretty normal, so I guess let's get some wood. Wait, what happened to my piece of wood? I swear I just broke it. All right, let's try this again. And what is going on? Are trees like invincible in this new update? Why can't I grab wood? Oh, yeah, you must have forgotten. Oh, great. What did they change now? The blocks lag quite a bit, so you have to break a block five times to actually get the block. Five times? Are you kidding me? Uh, yeah, five times. You seriously don't know that? Do I seriously have to break this five times? Oh, let's go. Finally, a piece of wood dropped. Just need some food to start off this world. Oh, look at all these cows and pigs. My lucky day. Time for some cooked pork chop. Let's go. Wait, what? Yo, is this like a god pig or something? Why isn't it taking any damage? All right, I am so confused right now. Well, what do I do now? Wait, did the pig just disappear? Where'd it go? All right, that pig was definitely messed up. Let's try this one. Again? Wait, where are they going? Why do they keep disappearing? How am I supposed to get food? Okay, maybe it's just a pig thing. I guess we'll try getting the cows. Bro, are you serious? All four cows were just here and they just disappeared. What is going on? This is not good. I might starve soon. Dang, looks like all the animals are gone. Wait, Joofy, the animals disappeared for you too? Yeah, I think all the animals must have lagged out and left the game. What? What do you mean the animals lagged out and left? How could they leave? Yeah, I think they had really bad internet or something. That makes no sense. Animals are a part of Minecraft. How do they have internet? Eh, it's all right. They'll be back soon, hopefully. Dude, I am so lost right now. Yo, a village. Let's go. 
Well, if all the animals lagged out, maybe I can find some food here. I wonder if this villager here has anything to offer. Oh, hey, you must be new here. Are you looking to trade with me for some items? Oh, yeah, definitely. Do you have any food? Food? Of course, I have plenty. Do you have anything to offer? I'm not gonna lie. I only have six wheat seeds on me. I don't know if that's enough to get any food. This is perfect. Take all this steak. Oh, really? No way. Thank you so much. This is way too generous. This is perfect. Take all this steak. Wait, what? You're offering me more steak? Seriously, man, I do not need that much steak. You're good. This is perfect. Take all this steak. Dude, I just said I don't need any more steak. Why do you keep throwing it at me? Oh, no way. You found a lagging villager? That's such a great find. A lagging villager? What is that? Yeah, sometimes the villagers lag and they forget to trade with you and they just end up giving you infinite trades. I got so many diamonds from this one villager, it was so sick. Wait, so will they ever stop trading? This is perfect. Take all this steak. Stop, please, bro. I don't need any more steak. This is perfect. Take all this stop steak. Stop dropping steak! Okay, let's check the time. Let's check the time. All right. Should be any minute now before the daily lag reset. I hope Evbo didn't build anything. That would suck. One more block and it's done. Let's go. I finally finished this insane house. Oh my gosh, this took me forever. Oh god, this is not gonna be good. Did you seriously not know about the lag reset? The lag reset? What do they keep adding to the game? What is that? Every day at noon, the world lags and resets all builds in the last hour. What? So what happens to my house? Well, did you build this house within the last hour? I mean, maybe. I don't know when I started it. Oh, where did my house go? What? What happened? Bro, are you serious? Every block just got erased? Oh my gosh, all my hard work. You really should have learned about the lag update before playing Minecraft again. Why would Minecraft add this as a feature? This is like the worst update I've ever played. All right, good work, guys. I thought that scenario turned out great. Juffy, what are you talking about? What scenario? Wait, he's still up? Shut it down, shut it down. What, who's saying that? I'm doing it, I'm doing it. Jeez, that was a close call. Hey guys, boss just called a meeting. He needs everyone there, let's go. Oh man, boss really brought everyone in here? Do you think boss knows we screwed up on that last simulation? Just be quiet. You've all done well. The simulations are running as planned. Keep bringing me more ideas and we'll keep running more scenarios. But I don't want any more mistakes. Let's get back to work. I don't even know. Whoa, what just happened? Hello? See what? Where did I just go? Seriously, if this is another prank, can you just tell me now? Wait, who's that talking down there? It sounds like Siwa. This is bad. We've never had an Evbo escape before. It's fine. We don't need to worry. He's probably gone. I'll go get the other simulation started. Am I the Evbo that escaped? What is going on right now? Why can't I remember anything that happened to me? Let's see. I was playing on my normal Minecraft world. No, it wasn't normal. Everything was super flat and I pranked Siwa? And now I'm here. Okay, okay, okay. Let's break this down. I escaped. People are looking for me and there's simulations going on. And just when I thought I was getting the slightest idea of what was going on. No, no, no. This can't be possible. That's me. I don't understand. I'm so confused. As I continued down the corridor, all I saw was the same thing. Just a copy of me laying on a bed. Whatever was going on in this place had to do with me. And I needed to find a way out. It seemed like the trapdoors were my only way out. But luckily enough, there were levers up here for me to use, so I grabbed one to use for my escape. It must have been in some sort of air vent system, which means this must connect to the whole building. But I needed to find a room that didn't have an Evbo on the table. Finally, I found a trap door that looked like it led to a different room, so I opened up the trap door and I jumped on down. Fortunately, no one was there waiting for me. It looked like I was in some kind of storage room. I took a look inside all of the barrels, but I found nothing. This doesn't make any sense. What is this place? Just as I turned around, I saw someone walking towards me, so I immediately booked it and found cover behind some boxes. Man, I swear Evbo has an obsession with command blocks. Hey, did that last Evbo pass all the tests, or did he not? No, that one was definitely supposed to be deleted. You know what? Just let me handle it, and you go back to work. Who were those people in the hazmat suits? What did he just leave here in the storage room? Wait, command blocks? What could they be doing here with command blocks? And what did that guy say about taking that Evbo to the delete room? Oh, I didn't like this, but I was gonna need to follow him. I would prefer not to find out what would happen if I got caught, so I was being super careful not to be spotted. Fortunately, I just saw the direction the hazmat guy was walking, so I followed him down the hallway. And that was when I stumbled upon a machine I've never seen before. 
What is this place? I had no clue what this machine was, but it looked like some sort of energy reactor or something. All I knew was that whatever this machine was, it was powering something big. I followed the hazmat guy down the hallway, but then I found something I couldn't quite explain. Oh my god, what is going on here? I wanted to digest what was going on, but I also didn't want to be caught, so I hid before the hazmat guy could spot me. Let's see, this one was Minecraft, but players forget everything. Alright, let's wipe memory and remove from the system. There we go. Now I gotta find that F-Ball that escaped or boss is gonna be real mad. I don't get it. All of these are copies of me that are gonna be deleted soon? Why? I don't get it. So am I the real Evbo, or are these just copies of me? Wait, what does this say? View count low. What does that mean? View count low. This one also says it. Wait, this one says view count low and this one and wait, all of these say view count low. What does that mean? What are view counts? I don't get what's go- what the- I got him, boss. I'm bringing him to you right now. Ah, oh, man, what just happened? I just blacked out there for a minute. Whoa, where am I? It's quite beautiful, isn't it? What? Who said that? So much power, so much potential, and soon it will all be mine. Who are you? What is this place? <laughs> Who am I? I am just like you. What? Well, not exactly. You see, all Evbos behave the same way. You guys play in your worlds, you enjoy it, you never think twice about the bigger picture. But I, I was the one who figured it out. I realized that someone out there, someone bigger than me, was controlling me. I didn't know what name to give them, but I called them the Creator. I didn't understand, but I knew that when the Creator joined, I lost my free will. Whenever the Creator wanted me to move, I would move. Wherever the Creator wanted me to go, I would go. And I realized the Creator was using me. Using me for what? I didn't know. But what I did know is that the Creator realized I wasn't good enough. The Creator left me, started making more copies of me, more Evbos, and using them instead of me and this whole time I've been trying to figure out what did those Evbos have that I didn't have. But what the creator didn't anticipate was that I would find a way out of his world. And so I started my own world. I started running these simulations to figure out what were the best Evbos and how could I use them. And you've been deleting all the ones that don't pass the tests. Wait, then where are the ones that do pass the tests? Oh, whoa, 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 now you're getting ahead of me. You didn't want me spoiling my master plan, did you? It's okay. You can take a look right in front of you. In this machine, you will see every single Evbo that passed the test. They are the ones that are going to be giving me everything I need. All of their personalities, all of their experiences, their memories, they will all be me. And after that, I will be the only Evbo left in this universe, and the creator will have to use me. But you won't be alive to see the end of that, so I think it's time we wrap this up. Are you serious? What are you doing? You can't do this. You can't just wipe out all Evbos just because... All right, that's enough wasting time. It's time to get to work. After today, the simulations will end and the creator will finally have the perfect Evbo. It's time to begin. Start up the transfer. Starting the sequence now. Sequence one out of eight complete. Ah, this is crazy. I can't believe this is happening. Is this really true? Are all Evbos gonna be gone after this? Okay, good, you're still here. Look, we have to go fast. I think we still have time to put an end to Evil Evbo. Wait, 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 slow down. What are you talking about? What's going on? Look, I didn't sign up for Evil Evbo's plan to wipe out all versions of himself, so I'm here to tell you how to stop him. Okay, okay, tell me what to do, I'm listening. When you were in his room, did you remember anything about it? Uh, let's see, he was explaining his mastermind plan to eliminate all Evbos? I don't know. No, 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 about the room. Did anything look off? to you some block or something there might have been this one thing i saw before blacking out i think it was there were command blocks under the floor of his room exactly this entire place is just another simulation powered by command blocks epo never actually left the simulation so if one goes down the entire place goes down Right, but there's only one command block that can do that, and I know where it is. You need to take this key. There's a secret keyhole next to the large staircase that will take you to the master command block. I would go, but only Evbos are allowed through, but you have to go fast. I'll go stall the other workers. You can do this. Oh my god, this is crazy. Okay, I need to go now. Sequence two out of eight completed. This must be the staircase the guy was talking about, right? He said the keyhole was somewhere in this room. There. I'm guessing I just placed the simulation key right here? All right, the door's open. It's time to go shut this thing down. We are at three out of eight. The guy said only an Evbo was allowed in here? Whoa, what is this? It's some kind of 
laser protected hallway. Oh man, if that guy was wrong about this and I go through the lasers, I could be dead in seconds. Sequence at 50%. I guess I have no choice. I stepped into the laser field, but to my surprise, I wasn't being hurt. The worker was right. Somehow being an Evbo made me invincible to the lasers. I got to the end of the hallway and I reached the master command block room, but I now had a huge problem on my hands. No, 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 this can't be right. The guy said there was one command block and there's hundreds. Sequence six, complete. How am I ever going to find the one that's going to destroy the simulation? This is impossible. There has to be some sort of code or... Wait, the patterns. Let's see. The arrows are all pointing towards this wall. And then all of these are squares. That one. The one with the circle has to be it. Sequence 7, successful. This has to be the one, right? Guess I have no other option. Otherwise, I might not exist tomorrow. Starting the last energy sequence. Come on, why isn't it breaking? Why isn't it breaking? 10 seconds remaining. Something's wrong. It should be broken by now. 3 seconds. I'm not gonna make it. 2, 1, break! Whoa, did, did it work? Transfer it, it, it. Where am I? Is the simulation over? Am I free? Whoa! What just happened? How did I get here? I can't move. Why can't I move? Oh, that's, oh, that's enough, enough recording, recording for, today. for today. I'm getting, I'm getting off. off. Do we need Do to we record, record anything, anything else? else? Nope, nope. Uh, should, uh, should be, be good. good. Thanks, Thanks though. though. Who was that?